Welcome back to another video of Supermarket Simulator. Anyway, let's play. I'm honestly wondering if I should upgrade another product license over here. Let's see here. It's bleach, cleaner, dishwasher, tablet, hand soap, shampoo, and toilet paper. So it is... Everything is on the shelf. We have one shelf standing outside. Um... Uh, let's see how close we can get to the entrance. Okay, so it's because there's a queue here now. I think this is fine. I think that's fine. Um, let's buy... Let's buy another... Well, let's buy the license while we're on the screen. Boom. Okay, management, furniture, uh, we want two more shelves, that's fine. Because we want toilet paper to be on its, uh, a shelf on its own. Most probably. Okay, let's turn it around. So I'm scrolling off. There we go. No, I'm not scrolling. Okay, that's fine. The shop is becoming extremely big now. Well, it's not big. It's just a lot of products and it will feel compact. Okay, so we're going to buy every product once. So... I mean, we buy two of each, by the way. Uh, then we need to check the stock. Uh, we need cheese and milk. And six-pack uh, six milk. Six pack milk, milk and cheese. So they will do their stuff while I'm doing this. Okay, so the cleaner, we have a cleaner, uh, spray, toilet paper, bleach. We got hand sanitizer. One, two, three, four. We're, we're still missing one. Let's see what is first. Bleach, cleaner, dishwasher tablet. We, we're still missing shampoo. There it is. So bleach is first. Now we'll just put it here. I will use this rack. So that's bleach. Uh, four, four point. Let's make it four point eight five. So bleach, then spray, uh, then spray. So spray a second. That is three fifteen. Um dishwash. Dishwash. So that's dishwash. Uh, 20, no, let's just say 21, I feel like. Let's say, let's say 20, uh, dot 7. Uh, 20.7. 
Okay, then it's hand, shampoo, toilet paper. So hand. Hand. Shampoo. Okay, we'll put shampoo here. And toilet paper. Okay, we'll buy all of them once again. Except for toilet paper, maybe. We want we want to get another shelf. Uh, because we need to get double toilet paper. So this is... Ooh, this is a big... Well, it's $5 profit. It's not that great. Um... 15.67, we'll make it 16, no, 6, 6, uh, this one will make uh, 6.2, okay, all of them, well, this one doesn't have a price, um, uh, 2.2, .2. okay, we need to buy another shelf, Honestly, I hope it's going to fit, because there's a chance it might not. I don't buy two of them. This one. Yeah, I don't think it's going to fit, dude. No, it's definitely not fitting. Um, hmm. Okay, it's, it's not a big deal. Because I wanted to buy two single uh, standalone um, shelves anyway. So now it's just the time for that. You better fit here. Turn, bro. Goodness. It doesn't fit as well. Ooh. I think... Turn! Goodness, overturned. Okay. Let's buy more toilet paper. Go through there. That's the shelf. So I overboard shelves, but it's okay. We'll use it later. And we can open the shop. Let's do that. So, stock taking. We shouldn't have bread, but we do. Which is weird because. Oh, okay. it is. It is. Don't worry. So we can buy bleach, hand sanitizer, spray, and toilet paper. So I think the toilet paper itself will be like, oh, I can't put it down because you can only put one down. One box down. Same with bleach. You see it saying it's full. So it's bleach or... Oh. 
Okay. So now we have cleaning products also, which is great. It's just great. Sucks that we can't use this space as well. So soon what will happen then is we'll move this one a bit more to the right so we can get another shelf in here. Once we upgrade the place, right? It will make sense then. Should we buy more shampoo? Yeah, I think we should. There's nothing there. Me, yeah, cheese. What's that? The white cheese? No, no, that's spaghetti. So, cheese. Red spaghetti also. And chocolate. Was that red? Yeah. And cheese. No, no. Chocolate. The money in this game is just flowing. It's absolutely ridiculous. The racks is full. He has toilet paper in his hand. It is, I took two off the shelf. Go put them there. I feel like that's also a glitch they have to fix. Like, if the guy is saying my racks is full, uh, I should have the option to take the object from him. I honestly think that is going to be the better solution. Hey girl, you're walking to me like you know me, or better yet, like you want me. <laughs> what do heck? Bum, 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 bum. You see, the thing is, your shop doesn't have to make sense. Like, all your cleaning products by each other, all your cereal by each other, all your sodas by each other. It doesn't have to make sense like that. As long as you have, like, a system where the game is functionable for yourself, not for... It's not for them, it's for yourself then you will succeed in the game. Do we have spaghetti? What do you have there? Water? Why? It's 
fill up two boxes. What do you do? Take that one on the ground, okay? Storage is full. He has water again in his hands. Dim 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 dim. I mean, you can also make the game look beautiful, right? You can buy cool-looking racks, which is more expensive. You can uh, put down signs. Why is this guy standing in a queue? What? Is he waiting for his wife first to buy? I don't know. Uh, that was just weird. She came out of nowhere, dude. You, we're using the aisles as cues. We'll eventually have another aisle down that this this one will be a part of. Just like this one. Okay, I think that's everyone that's here. Yeah. So you can press enter, end that day. Good stuff, good stuff. Making some money. Products found expensive, only one person. Don't care too much about that. Uh, tablet cleaner. Uh, 21. Dot two. Okay, so we need spray. Shampoo. What, what do you have there? Water again? Okay. So stock taking should only be only be in this area. So we want uh, shampoo and spray. Shampoo and spray. Uh, scroll up. We have some of those. We need six pack milk. Okay, let's just go down the list here. Boom, boom, boom. Gotta get that. Okay, then we need cheese. Cheese. Coffee. Red flour. Uh, spaghetti. Orange juice. Apple juice, six pack milk. Six pack milk. And olive oil. Okay, let's start the next day, dude. Yeah, you guys have a lot of work to do. Goodness. Don't worry, soon we'll have another friend. Soon. I don't know how soon, though. 
Goodness, she walks weird. What is wrong with her? What a cool name for a shop. I was gonna buy products, but rather spend money on you. Come here. Okay, we have three more lines down, so we can buy one more license, then the racks don't make sense anymore. And we have another we have enough money to buy more licenses. Requires level twelve, dude. Like we are level twenty four. We're double that already. Where did I stop? I stopped playing on on chicken. Yes, French fries chicken, yeah. So I'm almost exactly where we were. We bought a white shelf. Nice. <laughs> Idiot. So for us to continue on, because I don't think we can get anything else done here. Unless we move this forward and put shelves at the back behind it. It might just might just be more official like more efficient. There we go. To buy another upgrade in space. Before getting the product. Uh, I'm not going to do it right now. Bro, this guy needs water, I swear. We have a box here with three waters, dude. Okay, water is solved. Stop, stop complaining now. I think we want to maybe get more toilet paper. Like, I don't know. I, I don't know. I honestly don't. One next to it and up. Because we want... I, I think we want a full rack just for toilet paper and chicken. And potatoes. Like extra, extra space, you know. Because me buying... Like right now, if I buy... Uh, 2x toilet paper, you will see that they'll complain there's no space to to rack things. Uh, because they'll use two toilet papers here. Oh, two there, so that's a box. Okay, perfect. I just honestly don't want to deal with it, so I think we'll... We'll make three in total. And these guys love their toilet paper, dude. What are you doing? <laughs> oh man. So once you put the toilet paper down, I'll, I'll just duplicate it. Because next coming up is chicken, right? If I'm not mistaken. Honey, cheese, cheese, uh, four pack eggs, sugar. No, the next one is actually pretty easy. It's not, it's not chicken. The one after that is chicken. Where's the potatoes, dude? Is 
So potatoes on the right one. Right? Did I read it there? I don't know. All I know is we're close to it. Because I think we stopped at chicken. Goodness, it's dark. Pasta, rice, coffee. The very first cereal. And candy. Okay, now we can't buy again. We need six pack milk also. So we'll add that. Uh, shampoo. We need another light. Uh, shampoo. Toilet paper. Bleach. Dishwasher. So there we go. Still have clients in uh, in here, so we'll wait until they're done. Dude, it sucks, man. Like, I want this name to be Neon. I mean, even storage is, like, there's a light on it. Normally, stores have their name outside lit up. The only lit up thing we have is, is open. <laughs> okay, that's all clients out of the shop. Next day starts now. Oil, rice, tea. Oil, rice, and tea. Okay, I think we could, we can just instantly open. Right, we should be okay. I want to check if we have salt. We do. These guys love to place their toilet paper, but they hate to place the salt. They'll leave it until, like, there's only one left. What is that? Orange juice. Why did I buy too much of that? I didn't. Uh, orange juice is here. Box Destroyer Pro. Pro player. I mean, it's tempting to buy more of this, but I think I did. Is 
still just so much products outside. Do we have cheese? We do. The pro box destroyer. I think both of them are full. No. They weren't. Do we have that? What's it, the red flower? We don't. So we can buy a red flower. I think I did buy a six pack milk. One of these two should be. No, that's toilet paper. That's bleach. Where is the heck is the six pack milk now? Oh, there it is. There we go. See, the system works. It's just I'm impatient for these two to finish their job. So we, we need to check for the third worker, like how much we need to get him. Shop needs to be level 29. Racks. We need 13 racks in total, which is absolute stupid. Because we, we are close to the place where we actually need our third worker already. But it's not that needed at the moment. I think we'll play two more days, maybe one more day, one more full day after this one. And then we're gonna upgrade by license and move around a bit. This one needs to just move a bit more back so that we can get another rack here. And then the other rack will just go against it. Like this one. There's a rack behind, rack next to. And the queue will then be down the aisle. Also wish we can move the the switch, the light switch, to like, I don't know, somewhere by the entrance. Even this door, like right here, we can't build.
Goodness, he bought all the milk, dude. What are you doing there, girl? What are you looking for? Uh, are you looking for these nuts? Because I'll give it to you. How's the boxes outside? It's still quite a lot. Yogurt? What? What about the yogurt? What 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 is wrong about my yogurt? Too expensive? We need a lot of apple juice, bro. That's orange juice. We have no apple juice. So soon we can actually uh, take stock again. I think the last client just left. Yeah, kind of looks like it. Anyone complaining outside? No. Where's my second worker then? Oh, there he is. Okay, we'll end the day. Product's expensive. <laughs> Okay, cereal, dishwasher, and bottled water. Which cereal, though? This one? Yeah, this one. Cereal, uh, dishwasher. Dude, that price is still fine. And what was the other one? Bottled water, right? Yeah. So, stock taking time. Bleach, toilet paper, shampoo, hand sanitizer. Why am I in the loan screen? Okay. Uh, chocolate. Both cheeses. Uh. Uh, six pack milk, apple juice, turkey. Uh, Turco. That looks fine. So then, salt. Pasta. Pasta. Uh, peanut butter. Milk. It's regular milk, right? Yeah. Um, what's that? Oil, pasta, blue, and bread. Okay, I think that's everything.
That way they'll use the uh, smaller one first. Yeah, they have a lot of work to do. We'll just open the store. Get another day on the go, baby. I'm on top of the world. I look down on everyone, dude. <laughs> Oi. What are you doing? I'm running a shop. What are you doing? <laughs> With my bicycle. That's my that's my bicycle right there. Are you winning, son? We. How's our products looking, eh? Hey, finally someone put on salt, dude. Yeah, we're doing fine with two workers. So oil must still be here. There's there's peanut butter. We must have oil. There it is. Do we have the red pasta still outside? What do you have? Two bleaches? There's two bleaches in here and you have two bleaches. There you go. We don't have a brain cell. I think we need to buy more toilet papa. Because they love to, to fill up the toilet papa. Even their toys, you know what I'm saying? Do we have tea? We have so much tea, bro. Why does she look so angry? Smile. Okay, you only get to live once. You know what I'm saying? 
So give me your number. It looks so angry, bro. Look at that. Goodness. He's checking her out. <laughs> Don't worry, me too, bro. There's a twin sister. Also angry. Goodness. People are buying like crazy. I'm gonna reach this light bulb. Give me five minutes. <laughs> Dude, we're definitely using every inch we can. Just like I do in real life. You know what I'm saying, ladies? Yeah. <laughs> if you don't have much to work with, you gotta be good. You know what I'm saying? You know, you know what I'm saying? You know, I was planning. I was planning to play the whole day the card game because I, I I wanted that to be my first simulator we finish. But then this series also did well. Part one did well, so I was like, eh, you know what? Why not both? So I'm gonna play one game, this one game, the other one, and just keep shuffling. I just wanted to get like a really good start again on this game. Because after, like, after I know what to do, like, the game was just, it was so complicated. Especially all three of my workers just standing here, like, with a box in their hand. And I'm like, damn, dude, I don't know what to do anymore. But now, now I do, right? We don't overbuy. We only do stock taking. Pretty much at the end of the day or at the morning. Because we are selling a whole stack, bro. We're selling a whole stack. So the, the less you have here, the more you have in here. So it depends on what you prefer. I prefer one item per, per whole stack, if that makes sense. Because it can last a full day. Like, maybe not toilet paper, chicken, or uh, potatoes. I, I do get that. So everyone's out of the store, yeah. And the boxes outside is floating. Yay. Okay, we'll skip the day. Still 41 uh, clients though. Shampoo went up. A bottle of shampoo. That's actually a good uh, up right there. So seven, like I'm typing, but nothing happens. Pressing seven again. It's free. <laughs> seven dot one, I would say. 15, 10 cents more, you know what I'm saying? Okay, is it time to stock take or should I just wait a minute? We maybe wanna wait a minute. Yeah. Maybe people walk here and they're like, oh, this place has ghosts. 
That's why they have good prices. No. <laughs> Let's finish one box at a time, huh? What do you say? Okay, so I don't see any boxes here anymore, but there's still 17 on the ground. Shampoo should be here. Chocolate should be here. This one has... <laughs> Bro, it's not working as good as I hoped. Cold drinks should be here somewhere. Shampoo again. Okay, stock take time. Hand sanitizer. So, hand sanitizer. Uh, toilet paper. Dishwash. Maybe want to buy another toilet paper. Let's just see how much toilet paper we have in store. Yeah, well, nah. One should be fine. Um, okay. Cereal, cake. Orange juice. Isn't apple juice? It's apple juice, right? No, it's orange juice. The orange juice and the cool drink right next to it also. Okay, so that row is done. Uh, spaghetti, rice. Olive oil. Spaghetti, rice, olive oil. Uh, cheese, red pasta, uh, sugar, and cereal. Cheese, red pasta, sugar, and first cereal. Okay, stock taking is done, dude. Let us open. Oh, dude, I should have upgraded now. It's okay, we'll go one more day. You see, the problem is, though, that these guys, in my opinion, how it should have been programmed for the system to work perfectly, they should take the item from here... Instead of inside the shop, they take it here and place it, and then take it to the shop. Uh, the reason for that is because some boxes have like one item in them, but then they use a box from outside that has 10, and they put in like 5 on the shelf, and then there's no place to put a box anymore. So th that's, in my opinion, an issue. They're using the new box every time instead of using the box that is less that has less in the storage i mean waiting for them to rack up right is not going to solve the issue it's a programming issue in my opinion maybe what is the other option? There's two options we have for them. Two settings. Working, yes. Oh, okay. Well, that's not going to change anything. But I honestly believe if they change that one thing, uh, the game will be a lot more fluent, if that makes sense.
They will still prioritize an item. Like an item needs to be racked or whatever. Because, you know, the percentage is low. But instead it will be from... It will be first from here and not from the outside. The outside is secondary. It should be used items that gets used first, not items from the outside. The outside items should just be racked inside the storage. Because I feel like majority of the times we have problems is because they are not taking the storage first. They're taking it second. Like we're sitting there with a box with two bleach in it, another box with one bleach in it. Like what? what is, what is that then, you know? It's not gonna do anything. And I have to grab the box, go to the bleach, and right-click so that all the bleaches is in the box I have. And then I'll be like, oh no, we're low on bleach. And also, I think they should change it to percentage-based. Instead of number-based. That's the two changes from coding that I would have done if I made this game. Other than that, I think this game is pretty good. I would also add a thing where if you click on a uh, click on the price and you click on the market price, that it would change to the market price. It shows 705 there, so if I click on it, it will be my price will be set to it. It will just be so much easier. I don't have to type anything. If I want to just be market price. And you can also maybe right click on a shelf. Or I don't know. Go on your PC and do it. But set everything to market price. And you can maybe pay like a premium. Like something like I don't know. $10,000 for the service or something. That will automatic market price your whole building. Because then I don't care about prices then anymore, right? It will go up or down with the market. I, I don't, honestly don't care. Because at the end of the day, I still make profit if I sell at market price. So I feel like a service like that could also be phenomenal. That service is also not in the card game. And you can add it as a worker, but like, I think it's unnecessary. It could just be like a customization upgrade or something, you know? Customization, or just paid $100 a day or something, or I don't know, something like that. Uh, set everything to market price, one button, boom. You click it, pay $100 or something, and that is just done. But my personal opinion, make like a service. So management is a, I don't know, another service here. It doesn't have to be a guy. It just has to be like a service. Like It could just be called market or something. I don't know. Ooh, we can change the floor. Is it $200 per tile? Could be, it could be. People sing along. 
Because, like, sure, you could say, hey, uh, you should do that manually, changing stuff to market price. But just keep in mind, right, I have, I have, like, 20 products right now. Maybe more. Maybe 20, I don't know, 24. Once you have that 80 products and you, like, have the store that goes until the end of the street... Yeah, it's going to become problematic, right? People are going to complain about prices because you have like seven products to edit and there's eight different serials alone. You don't know which one is what. It just it, It's just going to become so messy unnecessarily. Okay, I think that was the final client. I don't see anyone else walking around other than my workers. So we'll end the day. Uh, we might want to do our stuff right now. We have enough money. Uh, so chocolate's price went down. So 320. Uh, let's do it. So for us to make this work, this is just luxury stuff. We don't need it right now. I feel like we'll get it way later in the game. Growth. So we need we want to expand once more. So 750. So one more expansion. No, we need another one. There we go. Um I think it would be a lot faster to just move this one back. Okay, we need another shelf in here. Okay, then this one needs to move down until it's not red. And then this one... Okay, we can't place it. Because this one's too close. And this one... Not aligned. Don't care. Open rack here. Is my dude just standing now? Yeah. Okay, we can do stock taking then. So one, two, three, four, five. And then water. Uh, we could just buy the new license also while we're at this screen. So one, two, three, four, or five, water, water, uh, peanut butter, red flour, peanut butter, red flour, and we have blue, uh, spaghetti, um, Apple juice, spaghetti, apple juice, uh, just buy six pack milk, always out of milk, dude, six pack milk, we can buy candy, Candy. I feel like buying the cake also. We only have one of them left. Okay. And it's the shelf. So it's bleach spray. Bleach spray. So 
So it's this. Bleach, spray, uh, dishwasher, and and toilet paper. Change all of this to two each. Cheese, mozzarella. Uh, cheese, harm, harmasan, honey, tuna, four eggs, and then sugar. So it is, it is two shelves. Well, we have one shelf that's empty, I think. So it's one shelf and one freezer or uh, fridge, sorry. It is this. So this shelf is open. Okay, that's the sugar, the new sugar. It's the tuna. Tuna must probably will go here somewhere. You know, we buy canned tuna in South Africa. <clears throat> Ours is not refrigerated. There's the white cheese, yeah? So red cheese, white cheese. Okay, white cheese, red cheese, then honey. So... White cheese. It looks so much like... Oh, is it fridge? So, okay. These two are in the fridge then. Then honey. So, honey is product number three. So, red, then white. It's... No, no, it's white, then red. White, then red. Uh, market. Yeah, fur. Okay. A uh, double fridge. It is the black color. We'll buy two of them. Turn around. You're almost there, buddy. Thank you. I need to honestly get a new mouse, dude. So, 11.35. Oh, that's four eggs. So four eggs also. So we'll get the white cheese now. What? So white cheese. That's my other small shelf.
So that's white cheese, red cheese. Five point, let's just say five. Uh, five point two, five. Okay, so then it's then it's tuna, four eggs, and then sugar. So then it's tuna. Four eggs. And then sugar. Fifteen. Okay, we have a whole open space here, which sucks, but it will get filled sooner than you think. Still have bleach outside. Okay, so we'll buy every new product again, and then we'll open shop. I think we need to buy those eggs a lot a lot more than others. So we'll buy six eggs. And then we'll open. Who's littering? Who's smoking? Is one of my workers smoking, dude? Goodness. What the heck? From the outside it looks so big and when you walk in it's like, dude, there's so much products like uh, stacked on top of each other. It's... We did stock take efficiently, right? Uh, we can buy olive oil. So now it's efficient, I think. So if I upgrade tomorrow, which I don't think we will because we're decently low on money, we will be close to where I was because I, I was selling chicken. You're selling a product without setting prices. Uh, two dot two. My bad. Uh, seven seven dot seven seven dot five. I'll make it four seven dot four. Wonder why it shows average price and then market price. A oh, average cost. That is what we pay. The sucky thing now is our bread, these these two items here, is the furthest away for them to walk. So it's all the way there. So that's the only sucky thing, I, I think. Looks like we need milk also. Where's the other worker? Standing with two bleach again in his hand. So let's see here. Bleach. This is a box with three. Uh, 
Again, olive oil? No, dude, we might have outside here. There we go. I do think, however, I do think we need milk. It kind of looks like it. Just the regular milk. You know how much we can still do? I think we can get two, maybe potentially three more licenses before we have to upgrade again the place. But our storage says different at the moment. Our storage is... Well, if you put... No, no. Yeah. We can put a rack here. Also. For the next products. Um, I feel like, honestly, the toilet paper extra is needed. So, below that will be like... Uh, chicken. So, two racks for chicken. Two racks for potatoes extra. So this one will move here. Like this. And we'll finish this one first. And then we'll do this one. I think it's only two racks, so it's only... Well, it's two more licenses here. This is... Why is it so weird? Did I miss a line? No. Uh, this one also work because we need three on the side yeah this also won't work six pack milk is running low dude six pack milk is just selling like absolute craziness Okay, so we need, what's it, rice? Okay, so blue flour, uh, rice, and red flour. That's after 9 p.m. Oh, yeah, we need lights also. I feel like this thing can move a little bit more. It might be the door that's blocking it though. Do 
Dude, if an actual shop in real life is upgrading this fast, you must know that they are ripping you off. Like, honestly. They are ripping you off, and that's why they can grow this fast. Like my bread, for example, dude. It costs a dollar, I'm selling it for four. Like, how stupid. I'm making... I'm making, four, like, four times, three times my money per item. Well, not per item, but for bread alone. We have 50 clients, 50 customers. This is our first time ever reaching that. So tea and coffee, price has changed. Coffee, oof, dude. That's now 9, 9.55. Uh, six dot, let's say six dot two. Okay, stock taking time. I, I think we have enough money, but I would rather do one more day. Just to be a hundred percent sure. So we bought, I think most things here that was empty. The flour. Okay, so we need to buy sugar. I think we did buy rice. Sugar. I'm gonna just buy rice again, should I? I I I don't think so. Uh chocolate. So chocolate. Uh bleach spray. Uh bleach spray. Toilet paper. Reach play toilet paper, uh, white, red honey. Uh, white, red honey, and the last two. Uh, how's our eggs doing? It's it's looking good. It's looking good. Okay, we can just open shop. We did stock take. First two clients. See, the Let's Play Master thing looks pretty nice during the day, but at night, it, I, in my opinion, it should be neon. It should be neon glowing, like any convenience store's name. And if we do need more self cashier stuff, uh, we could just like, you know, put in every line one later down the line. That guy is waiting in queue for someone else. <laughs> it's like the queue can start from far away and then someone else wants to queue also. And now all of a sudden the guy that's closer is now second. I feel like distance should take a factor, especially if you have a big store and your totals go all the way down.
What is that? Bleach again? Let me guess. Uh, what do I know? Wait, there's five in this one, dude. Yeah, you'll you'll just have to wait a minute. Yeah, you have three in yours, I think. Four. There you go, buddy. Wonder if Bleach also needs an extra slot. It might just be more convenient. But again, I could I, I could put it here, the extra slot. But then I'm like, my brain is like not functioning that it's there. But I see it's empty there and I buy two anyway. So it doesn't solve the problem. The problem is... They shouldn't be taking from the street inside and putting it on the shelf. They should be taking it from the storage to the inside. It's a simple, like, coding problem in my opinion. See, there could be spray inside with that's, I don't know, has three inside a box. But now he's using the full box and then sometimes there's like two inside. You don't really see the problem with the early products, but you will see it with the, the big ones. Like bleach, for example, like toilet paper. Like chicken, like potatoes. The, the, the problem will occur often there, more often. Also from here, I can actually see whether people complain about prices or whether an item is not there. Dude, people are just streaming into the shop, dude. I think we made over $2,000 today. It's 9 p.m. Look how busy the store is, though. Another guy. Dude, it's so full. 
Oh my goodness, there's so many people in here still. Nah, dude, we're gonna become a millionaire in this in this playthrough. Easy peasy, dude. After you play this game, you wonder, like, how does convenience stores ever run out of money? Ever. And it's because, number one, client satisfaction is a big key. So either if you're selling junk or you're selling, you know, products that either taste weird or uh, it's not what you buy, right? Then people will stop going to your shop. It's actually that simple. So don't sell products also like milk that is sour. But I mean, that at least that function is not in the game. So I can stock up on milk in the storage, which might be hot, but it doesn't matter. Is the shop empty now? It looks like it. That guy's just restocking. So we can press enter here, end the day. Now is 6,600 enough to build more? I think it is. So... Yeah, these guys are still gonna walk for a bit around, so I think what I'll do is uh, we'll, we'll buy the next upgrade. Purchased. Next license. So we'll scroll down. We have butter, cereal, chicken, french fries, pizza, and a potato bag. So I'm going to buy these items first. And move them at least. Okay. So potato bag. It's a... Butter. French fries. Chicken. Didn't solve the shelves yet. Uh, solve the shelves yet. So we need to buy we need to buy two toll racks. What? Why is so skew from the get-go? Okay, two racks. Then on the screen it's... Oh yeah, we need to buy two lights as well. Okay. Um, 
Then we can stock take what they're doing, right? So... So... Is it that? Yeah. Olive oil. Olive oil. I'm gonna buy more six pack milk this time. Okay, is it is it apple juice? That's no, orange orange juice. Orange juice uh white candy. Orange juice. Candy. Okay. Uh, spray, toilet paper, dishwasher, hand sanitizer. So spray, hand sanitizer. Oh. Hand sanitizer, uh, dishwasher, and toilet paper. Okay, then white and red cheese. White and red cheese. Uh, tuna for eggs. Tuna for eggs. I think I bought four of something, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, now it's the new products. So it's butter first. Fridge, shelf, freezer, 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 shelf. So it's butter. Butter, cereal. And chicken. Oh my goodness. Butter. We have another cereal here. Is it the B cereal? It is. Cereal and chicken. Cereal chicken. Um, French fries, pizza, potato bag. So we're, we're gonna start here. So, French fry, French fry will be up here. French fry, pizza, and potato bag. That's fine. Okay, so we need one shelf. A double one, dude. That's a single one, right? 
Yeah, it's a single shelf. So, let's see here. One double shelf. I think I bought two of them. Mm, we'll put it here. And that will be the only two things that can go on a shelf. Which is butter. No, 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 it's not butter. Which is uh, the cereal. Uh, 5.30, which is a cereal and potato. See, we... Oh, he took something from me. So now we need freezers. Um, we might want to bring in that single rack, I think. Do we have anywhere to be able to place it? They threw away the... Yeah, it's too far leaning out. What if you turn it a bit? Yeah, it's too far. It's not gonna work. Unless it's like here. I mean, we do have another double shelf if we wanted to do it. Just I want the potatoes to be there. Um, then we want to buy double, f maybe triple freezer even. I think double freezer should be enough. Um, so double freezer. I think we'll just start on the outside so. So that's a freezer. Only chicken will be in here. So 9.4. Another freezer. Please tell me you're gonna fit. It's not, is it? Fucking go down, bro. Oh my goodness. Are you kidding me? We got it. This is in the fridge. Okay, we need another fridge. So this will be for our french fries. Uh, 6.15 and our pizza are 
Are you kidding me? So little. Five dot twenty. Uh, so now we need to buy more potatoes. So we buy potatoes and we buy a double. A double fridge. There we go. Did I buy two of them? I think I bought two of them. They took away my butter. Okay, this is 2.7. Yeah. 2.7. So, they're standing around. So, we're going to open it up. And we're going to just take stock again. So, we can buy toilet paper. Toilet paper. Uh, red. Pasta, and that's it. And then red pasta. Okay, so we can buy Bees and chicken again. So, bees, chicken. Yep, bees and chicken, dude. That's it. So, stock take is done for the day. We have $200 left, dude. <laughs> wow. That is absolutely insane. Or should I rather say, <coughs> perfectly calculated. Oh yeah, I wanted to buy more potatoes. That's chicken. I bought more potatoes to put on the other shelf. There we go. So we have one potato here. So I feel like we can buy potatoes again. Don't mind my chicken just, you know, turning bad here. What level do we need for another worker? Level 20, nice. But to be honest, I think two is still enough. How 
How's that butter looking? I did buy quite a bit of it. Like, quite a bit. So it should just be laying outside. Everything is still looking good, dude. FBI is inside here. Four people with the same tuxedo. Five. Goodness, there was five. There's six. The guy on the right also, the bald guy. Goodness, we were attracting business owners, dude. Or the FBI. That guy, no wonder you look like this, bro. No wonder. Did you know what he bought? He bought two potato packs, two um, pizzas, and ol uh, and not olive oil, uh, normal oil. Uh, three oils. No wonder. Holy, bro. You need some milk. <laughs> Oh, the day is almost uh, done. How's the lights looking, dude? It's looking perfect. We'll eventually change the walls and the floors, but I feel like that is something for us, right? It's something for us to experience. To be quite honest, there's nothing wrong with the floor we have. And a yellow wall, I mean... White would have been better, but... If I'm gonna paint it, it will be a color. Like, maybe black. Maybe black, yeah. Or, like, shocking pink. Like our neon sign. If, if that color is even there. Would be cool if we can make our own color. Just like we chose that color, right? Bro, it's nine o'clock and you're still walking in. Goodness. Look at her also. She's not even running. Well, oh, she's walking fast though. Yeah, I think another worker right now is a little overkill. Two is perfect for the shop stall. We had $250 left when we opened the shop this morning. So we're almost making three grand a day. <laughs> oh my goodness. I believe that's the last guy out. 54 clients, bro. 
everyone's happy because I just have big dick. I mean, I, I'm good at video games. Um, let's see here. Uh, shampoo, french fries, and uh, something powder. What? That's a big jump. Shampoo. Shampoo went down quite a bit. So that's a... Uh, five... Five point eight five. I honestly don't know what the powder thing is that they're talking about. Shampoo. Oh, there it is. Sugar. It's the new sugar. Uh, 12.7. Should be good. Get it stock take. We need french fries. No, no, no. Yeah, french fries. We need uh, potatoes. We need a butter, cereal, uh, honey. Butter, cereal, honey. Honey, uh, white cheese, bleach. White cheese. Toilet paper, bleach, uh, dishwasher, right? Shampoo. What if I bought shampoo? We didn't. Okay. Now we're at cereal at the top. So we can just go all the way to the top now. No, no. Okay, yeah, we can, we can. So let's see here. We need blue, so four, four and five. So it's, yeah. It's oil, sugar. We don't really need sugar. We'll buy anyway, because we only have three left. We need blue flour, uh, we need uh, milk, cheese, right, cheese, yeah, yeah, and milk, uh, we need black coffee, black coffee, uh, pasta, and rice. Pasta and pasta and rice. Um, and then apple juice. Apple juice. Chocolate. And yogurt. We can buy quite a lot of yogurt because it stacks really nice. Goodness. It's just a mess again. On the outside. Yeah, I think we bought everything. But yeah, guys, we're going to actually end this episode over here. We have a shop that is like making insane amount of money per day. We're close to $3,000 per day, um, which is absolutely ridiculous. And you can see we spend about 1800 to restock, but it obviously depends on what you restock. So 
But yeah, having a blast so far in this game. Hopefully you guys did enjoy it as well. If you did, please make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.